Right, so things to look out for with lacing it up then. These Tom mics are very thin, so they've been extended with normal mic cable. Um, if you stretch these and trip over them, that'll be the you know that'll be the end of that really. Um, moving over to the patch bay. Okay, so the patch bay then. Um, we decide a, a format. We know which. Uh, we just decide and agree which particular cable we're going to use for, or which particular socket we're going to use for which particular mic. So all you have to do is pre-decide which number for which mic and then stick to it so that your setup in the, in the live room here and in the control room is the same. So our pre-agreed setup is going to be kick drum, snare top, snare bottom, um, hi-hat, tom one, tom two, Tom 3, and that's going from high, medium, low, and then left overhead and right overhead. And those two overheads are, the left and right is taken from the perspective of the audience uh, looking at the drum kit. The only other thing that appears on the patch bay is, should be the headphone uh, pair, which is the return from the control room, which gives you your monitoring so you can listen to what's going on. And that goes towards the headphone amplifier. Headphone amplifier is over here. Um, and that that needs to be set up on the patch bay and set up in the control room.